Hey guys, let me see your war terminal. Ah. Commander. You said one of your ships had gone missing? Crashed, actually. I couldn't speak in front of the Krogan. Our ship went down on Tuchanka. Now they're pinned by an advanced guard of Reapers scouting the planet. What are your men doing there? I'm sorry. That's classified. But it's vital they be rescued. They must complete their original mission. It's a matter of... galactic peace. I'll do what I can. I appreciate your help. And understanding. I understand this is a difficult time for you, Primarch, but Earth can't survive without reinforcements. Can I still count on your help? If the Krogan help us on Palavan, then I give you my word. How is it being the Primarch? Not what I imagined. The battle of all time is happening on Palavan, and I'm light years away, reading casualty reports in the millions. If I'm going to die, I want to be with my men, so there's no doubt we fought to the last soul. I understand. Leaving Earth to save it. It's one of the hardest things I've ever done. I'm not surprised. Garrus speaks highly of you. You never asked to be a leader, yet your people will die if you refuse. We find ourselves in similar circumstances. Let's hope the spirits grant us the strength to see it through. How are things on Palavan? The casualty reports are staggering. The Reapers are using our own tactics against us. Destroy the enemy with overwhelming force. I've seen the same on Earth. The strategist in me admires their brutality. The Turian in me knows I'm watching the destruction of 15,000 years of civilization. My civilization. The Krogan will make sure that doesn't happen. Assuming you're successful with the cure. We will be. You have to be, Commander. I don't want to go down as history's last Primarch. Your men that crashed on Tachunka. How many are there? A platoon. You said their mission was a matter of galactic peace. Why? I'm sorry, Commander. As I said, it's highly classified. Look, if you want me to put my ass on the line, I need answers. I can't tell you. Please understand. The commander is Lieutenant Tarquin Victus. He'll be your contact. Victus? My son. I needed someone I could trust completely. The Salarian Dalatras was worried about what the Krogan will do once they're cured. How do you feel? It won't matter if we don't stop the Reapers. But I understand her doubts. The moon you found me on? That's where we made our last stand against the Krogan during the rebellions. They were that relentless. Reaching out to the Krogan for help must be difficult for you. We can't allow the mistakes of our past to cloud the future. Your race and mine were once enemies. The first contact war, as you call it. I was there, dodging shells fired by your navy. But look at us now. Standing in a ship of Turian human design, working together. How did it turn out? The Krogan started using asteroids as weapons. Directing them against our colonies. We had no choice. The genophage was our last resort. So yes, Krogan intentions after this war will be a serious concern. But I'd rather have a grateful ally than a resentful enemy. Thank you, Primarch. My thoughts are with Palavan. And mine with Earth. Alright, where's our Krogan, bro? I want to play Super Krogan 69. Ah, uh, here we are. Hell of a show down there on Sir Kesh. Just like the old days, Shepard. Right down to me pulling your ass out of the fire. I was the one with bullets flying at me. And I gave you the moral support to dodge them. Uh-huh. You said one of your squads is missing? They were scouting out the Rachni Relay. We've heard rumors of trouble in the area. Rachni? Thought that might get your attention. I have a favor to ask. It's big. Don't tell me they're back. All I know for sure is our scouts went silent as soon as they arrived. I've got Aralak Company, my best unit, on standby. 
You give the word, and I'll meet you there. I'll see what I can do. Get on it, Shepard. What will you do after the genophage is cured? Once we deal with the Reapers, most Krogan will want to settle a score with the Turians and Salarians. I won't let them. That isn't our path forward. This time we'll be different. If somebody did that to humanity, I'd want some payback. It's a vicious cycle. If we go after revenge, the Council will find some new way to put us down. It could be even worse than the genophage. My people aren't going through that again. What's the situation back on Tachanka? I'm still getting scattered reports of Reaper forces arriving. Something big is brewing. I won't let those things take Tuchanka. Not when we're about to cure the genophage. My people have had enough bad luck in our time. Back on Sirkesh, it looked like the female Krogan could hold her own. Our females don't lack for spirit. For males, a good show of force sorts things out. But females like to talk about it. Then think about it. Then talk about it some more. Women have good ideas, Rex. You should listen. Yeah, but they have so many of them. So sometimes I pretend to listen and... Well, let's just say Krogan females have tempers, too. How could there be trouble with the Rachni? They were all but extinct. The last queen promised to disappear forever or be destroyed. I know, I was there. I've got a bad feeling about this. It may not be Rachni, but maybe it is. Could be another invasion. If they're crawling out from under some rock, you know how bad it could get. We need to stop them. That's it for now, Rex. Let's get back to work. Anytime. And Shepard, I like what you've done with the Normandy. Got tired of always hanging around the cargo bay before. I still don't have a window like Liara does, but maybe that's because I don't kiss as well. <laughs> no comment. Yeah. <laughs> I miss this place. Wish I could knock some heads around with you, but duty calls. If the Solarian says my DNA is important, who am I to argue? All right. Here, talk to everyone as well. You think the Solarians would have a base on their homeworld secured better? Ah, they were solid. Cerberus has Reaper tech. Compared to those upgrades, the Solarians might as well have been throwing rocks. Commander, we've got new reports of Cerberus activity on Tachanka. I've marked it on the galaxy map. So my little guide here says to uh, go straight to Tachanka, so we're just going to do that. Gives an order here. Platoon, then bomb, then uh, some traverse with the Krogan team, and then some other stuff, so, you know. Uh, Thessia. You do maybe an offer and I accept I'm a specter. Alright. Uh, yeah, we're, we're not gonna go see Ashley. We don't really care. Unless she wants to be racist again. That's, that's always amusing. The best part of Ashley. What would Katie do? You just cry. The Krogan and the Turians really should get behind the Alliance. They've got so much in common, like shooting things and not wanting to die. And... No, that's about it. So, bringing the Krogan to a war summit went well? You want me to invite the Batarians too? Or the Vorcha? <laughs> I don't love the Krogan either. But we need shock troops that can stand against Reaper forces. Yeah, they stood against the Rachni too. Look how that worked out. Not too well for the Rachni. Okay, point taken. Still, good to have Morden back. The bad guys shouldn't get the monopoly on mad scientists. Commander. Commander. It is good you came by. I have questions about the genophage. Okay. And everyone else. What do you need, Edie? A Krogan female of breeding age can produce clutches of up to 1,000 fertilized eggs over the course of a year. There are over 1 billion females on Tachanka. If even 1% become fully fertile, they can birth 10 billion infants. On Earth, bugs have a lot of young, too. Most of them die. The attrition rate would naturally be high. But the state has an interest in keeping the children alive for warfare purposes. Any other cheerful thoughts? Logistics. Even were they to side with us, transporting the Krogan to the battlefields of Palavin could prove difficult. They have been demilitarized. That is, they have no warships. 
What do you suggest? They will need Turian or civilian starships to carry them to battle. With your permission, I will make the necessary calls to have these ships in place for when you deliver the Krogan. Do it. Anything else? Food. They will be unable to eat anything on Palavin. They must bring their own or rely on the nutrients in their humps. This keeps getting better and better. The Krogan will also require sedatives, since Krogan fight with others of their kind in enclosed spaces such as starships. Make it happen. Are there any last things you're worried about? Nothing that demands your attention, Shepard. Lovely. All right, we're gonna go to floor number two, and probably do nothing there. Uh, and that's it. Uh, there's no other floors that are of any importance to us. We could go actually. One sec. Let's go. Actually, we were on floor two, uh, so uh, technically floor th floor three. But I was actually thinking about this because someone was saying this isn't green enough. But the reason why it's not green is obviously because it's not actually the they don't roll a piece of armor, but well, let's let's have a look at some of these. What the, oh my goodness, dude! I look like something out of Tron. What does that one even do? It's power damage. But I, I want to be the Tron guy. Uh, I don't know. This is fucking dog shit, though. Shoulders. Oh, there you go. Headshot damage. Now you're speaking my language. Alright, how, how does this load out compared to... What was I using before? Is this the one? No. Is this one? Oh, shit, the other one's way better. This one's good. Oh, so that's maybe why I had so much ammo. is because of this. So yeah, we can maybe just try and do this instead. I mean, it doesn't seem like the best thing, but I honestly, I want to look like Tron, so... I fight for the user, and not Reapers. Alright, where's, uh... I can't imagine anything so traumatic. You sure you're okay, Karen? I wouldn't wish a collector abduction on my worst enemy. But it's behind me now. I'm fine. But it makes me think of Earth and all the other Reaper-occupied worlds. What are the Reapers doing to the people who live on all those worlds? As we sit here, enjoying our coffee. How many souls are in agony this very moment? Millions? Billions? Oh, Greg. I lied. I'm not fine. Everything okay in the med bay? Yes. Morden would just like some space to work with Eve. He kicked you out? Oh, no. I just felt I was getting in his way. I'll return when I need it. Commander. Hello, Commander. These guys are literally the worst. Oh, nobody's here. Hey, it's Kinsumi didn't want to fucking come back. Do you blame her? This ship smells. I guess we'll talk to Liara. Oh, don't definitely talk to Garrus, though. So, Liara, still relying on the Protheans for all the answers? It will work, Rex. We just need to finish building the Crucible. Although, I'd be interested to learn how you found out about it. Wasn't that hard. Lucky you keep its location more secret than the fact it exists. And I'm sure you'll do a good job of both, being so famous for your discretion. Good to see you again, Shepard. Ah, here we go. Remnants of Reaper Destroyer. Alright. Open. We're gonna do a store discount bonus. Or power recharge speed. I mean... Destroyer remains for a store discount, or... I, I would do the power recharge. Is money really a problem in this game? I don't think it is. Is that it? I guess that's it. I mean, five percent is a lot. Isn't a lot for either one. They're very minor, permanent upgrades. But yeah. Well, we'll talk to Morden soon. No way. Shepard, they say female Krogan have a thing for guys with scars. So I've heard. I've got a few myself. Here's hoping nobody's planning an arranged marriage to cement this deal. Though I have to say, I admire Eve. 
The things she must have endured living with the genophage. And now, to top it all off, she's her people's last hope. Imagine the pressure. It takes real courage to face that. I hope we can measure up. I guess we're at war with Cerberus now, huh? I've never actually seen a female Krogan. Seems like they're the real brains on Tichonka. Good to see Morden still alive and kicking, and still finding new ways to cause trouble. Not right now. Not right now. Not right now. Not right now. I guess not right now. Who am I to uh, say otherwise? Oh, jeez. Aware Krogan females find scars attractive. Garrus loyal, reasonably intelligent, bit aggressive, almost like Krogan. For the third time, Doctor, I'm not interested. Ah, Shepard. We were just... Are you okay? I'm fine, Rex. You can relax. Can't be too careful. Or put any faith in Solarian doctors. This one is different. Is he? What's that? Simple blood test. What kind? Kind that ends the genophage. Shepard, please. Distraction's counterproductive. Also affecting comfort of patient. Considering everything the Solarians have done to the Krogan, can you blame them? Yes. Eve's release my doing. Would never have known about her if not for me. That was then. But she's out now. And if she gets hurt, I'll feel it. Understand. But my patient, my responsibility, her welfare a priority. Will not allow her to be compromised by anyone. <laughs> You got a quad, Doctor. Keep her safe. Our females have endured enough. Don't forget, still need your tissue sample. I'll be back. Common phobia. Fear of needles. Or Solarian doctors. Now have work to do. Prefer females of the species. Dude, he, he snaps his neck in really weird ways. Maybe with an inhibitor. No, 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 no. Shepard, blood work complete. Indicates significant stress on Eve's system. Malin's data thorough. Fortunately, detailed as well. Have used notes to improve her condition. Have you determined why she's immune? Genophage targeted hormone production during pregnancy. Modification project used same modality. Her immunity, totally different. Targeted glands now obsolete, like human appendix. Other glands mutated to produce proper hormones, enable viable birth. Also explains her weakness. Gland substitution, imperfect. Health trouble. You think you can make this work for all Krogan? Yes. We'll use Eve's tissue to produce mutagen, alter gland function across entire species. Must improve mutagen as well, tune hormone production, long-term illness for all Krogan otherwise. So, we did the right thing by saving the data? Indeed. Would be much harder to treat Eve without it. Maybe impossible. And all those experiments we saw back on Tachunka? Monstrous, repulsive, but now with purpose. Victims didn't die for nothing. So, the end justifies the means? Not my means. But you're using the data, encouraging more experiments like Malin's. Encouragement irrelevant. Will always be scientists willing to perform unethical tests. Can't change that. But can help Eve. Can cure Genophage. Won't ignore data vital to her survival because of unethical origins. How is she doing? No fever currently. Heart rate elevated. Likely stress. Eating appropriately. Could use another blanket. Something soft. Prefer to let her recover fully before synthesizing cure. My medical recommendation. My people don't have time for that. Her opinion, somewhat different. You care about her? My patient, my responsibility. Found her at STG base. Three doctors injured trying to restrain her. Undid arm restraints. Didn't resist when she grabbed me. Promised to help her. She said, please. You always defended your genophage work. What changed your mind? Never changed mind. Genophage proper decision at time. New circumstances necessitate course correction. Those circumstances being? Reaper invasion. Turian's doomed without Krogan support. Krogan need unified threat, outlet for aggression, cooperative symbiosis. Nothing else? No personal stake here? Getting old, Shepard. Not many years left. But still best candidate for project. Few Solarian scientists interested in genophage. None with my expertise. Had to be me. Someone else might have gotten it wrong? Possibly. Stakes too high for inexperience. But not about them. My work. My job to put it right, to prove I can. Nice talking with you, Morden. Thank you, Shepard. Glad to be back. You planning to stick around when this is over? Until Reaper's dealt with, at least. Then, 
Not sure. Have made impact on Galaxy. Genophage modification, genophage cure, work against collectors, decisions, mistakes. Might go somewhere sunny, sit on beach, look at ocean, collect seashells. You'd go crazy inside an hour. Might run tests on the seashells. <laughs> All right. Uh, we didn't actually talk to Liara. We just kind of uh, used the computer. We're, we're just using her for our fucking shuttle broker computers. Let's be honest. Messages terminal has new correspondence. We don't care. Perhaps we can talk later. What? Perhaps we can talk later. What if we want to bang? Oh, that's a sad story. Holy shit! So you can like the entire episode to fucking talk to everyone. It's gonna happen like every time. I'm just gonna not talk. I'm not gonna go to the fifth floor, by the way. I'm just. I'm. That place doesn't exist to me. You're saying they survived into this cycle? Yes. We called them collectors. They fought for the Reapers. For a long time, no one knew they were Prothean. And when did you realize? Shepard had no choice but to kill the ones he encountered. They were all indoctrinated and had been for a long time. I'm sorry. I am grateful. It was an act of mercy. Yes. I suppose it was. Did I mention Salarians used to lick their eyes? How far they have come. The Morden Salarian asked if he could dissect me. I approved, but only if he could defeat me in combat first. His reply was problematic. Then he left. I do not understand that one. It's like Chin is clipping through his armor. This Cerberus. I do not understand why your own kind would oppose you. They will bleed the same as everyone if the Reapers are not stopped. The Rex Krogan offered me a job. He said whenever I tired of the easy life of luxury on the Normandy, he would give me something real to shoot at. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, 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 yes. I can make a beatbox. Yes, 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 yes. He does like this head twitch. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. It's all that stasis. Let's be honest. Yes. Alright. I don't think there's anyone on the bottom deck yet. And uh, Adams is talking to Chakwa, so. Alright. We're not going to the bottom floor, so. You know, that, that place is just off limits. Hope Ashley joins the ship and goes there too. Actually, we didn't talk to her. Commander, nice to see you again. How are you settling in, trainer? I actually feel somewhat useful. It's been challenging to integrate data feeds for the War Summit. How are the systems holding? Well, I'm glad we performed stress tests. Specialist Trainer has been extremely helpful. The accuracy of our War Room data is a direct result of her work. Thank you, Edie. I'm still getting used to all of this. In the lab, we'd hoard everything, piles of tech everywhere. Out here, it's like living out of a shoebox. And this is just with a skeleton crew. You should see this ship when it's fully staffed. Oh, uh, no, Commander. I'm not complaining. This is wonderful. Back in the lab, we had to hoard because we had no budget. Now? Edie, Ariaki Tech uses a proprietary smart processing algorithm that could clean up our long-range data. Can we license it? We can. Analyzing and applying the upgrade now. The algorithm should reduce long-range strategic combat data analysis time by 3%. Impressive. If it means getting the equipment I need, I can quite happily live out of a shoebox. Commander, I've set up a secure communications with the Turian and Salarian governments and added their combat data to our boards. Hopefully it'll give us some idea of what's going on. Commander? 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 Alright. Well, we're doing that. It's gonna be one of those things where we just kind of start one episode and... and get really sad, because... Apparently, I set myself with some arbitrary limits. Alright, so... Investigate missing sca- no, we're doing this one first. You know, 25 minutes is pretty good. I don't know why I feel like I have to make everything 30 minutes. Whatever. It's like, you're getting two episodes a day anyways. Fuck you guys. Bye.